Hello my darlings and welcome to my channel. So today's reading is gonna be about are you ready for this change or for those changes that are coming ahead in your life? I don't know what sphere is it going to be about for each pile or what uh, situation, but you may choose from those three um, crystals, pile one, pile two, and pile three. I'm going to add some cards for you to choose from, and we're going to see if you are ready for uh, what's about to come. Uh, just don't have any expectations, uh, whatever comes, okay? And if you feel you resonate with it, then maybe you are ready. <laughs> Pile one doesn't want to stay in one place, somebody's... Um, stressing out maybe i don't know but let's see let's start with pile number one hello pile one whoever chose this uh, crystal are you ready for those changes that are coming ahead queen of cups uh, you are uh, very emotional about those changes or you will be emotional about those changes when they actually at your door when they are um, when they hear you may be feeling emotional about them let's see what is this about what is this about what kind of changes oh my god <laughs> Wow, for some of you, uh, expect a, a love offer that you always wanted or waited on or you dreamed of or if you were manifesting a person, a partner, a couple and you were constantly thinking about it or as I said, manifesting it, uh, you did some rituals or you man uh, meditated on it, uh, the chance is coming and um, I want to say you are ready um, in 3d you are ready like the universe is telling you you are strong enough or ready to receive those changes definitely a change with the death card which is like a transformation uh you're ready for it but as i said you emotionally you may be uh experiencing some turbulence i hear that uh, this is just because you uh you know when like we wish for something and when it's finally here we kind of cannot believe it or we worry that it will go away or uh, it's just in our head or we had some illusions but changes are coming and they are necessary i hear uh, why because you kind of already even i want to say you overweighted or not overweight like you're gonna gain weight no <laughs> you waited kind of more than enough more than enough for this to come you more than prepared but emotionally what could uh, not bring it to your life yet is your emotional worries about it physically you ready energetically you ready so for many of you it's gonna be about love offer if it's not let's see what else could it be here because many people are watching what else could it be here what kind of changes A certain emotional fulfillment as I said it's more about how happy you're going to feel or how content you're going to feel when this actually comes into your life I sense a luxury a luxury uh, maybe you wanted something that you will get maybe you will buy or you will own even or you will win a certain competition depends on what you are manifesting first thing that comes into your mind what's the main thing that you feel you lack right now or you want really bad and um, that's what it is no need to wonder what it is you already know the first thing that came into your mind what this reading could be about that's what's gonna be you. 
you know what else just came when this wish is coming the sign will be a sudden rain it will suddenly rain this is very specific for some when the wish is uh, actually here there will be raining suddenly maybe even rainbow will come after this rain but it's gonna be unusual rain it's not just a rain because rain like it's something that usually happens but this is gonna be unusual rain for some reason okay uh, what else you need to know pile one for some of you the hint will be whatever you want didn't work before or you put a certain effort into something and it didn't work you basically failed before in this or in this situation in this um, wish with this wish with the, maybe it's a job that you didn't get or a relationship that didn't work out something here could be didn't happen before this time this time you will be lucky but what do I mean by lucky it's basically your fate uh, this time it's 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 happening I'm truly happy for you pile one uh, I feel your strong uh, I just heard pr protection but also um, you pre you are very prepared here you're very prepared so if you even if you're gonna be a, a bit over emotional that's fine it's not gonna like get your wish away it's not gonna ruin anything when it's here you'll know beautiful beautiful energy thank you very much pile number one and i'm going for pile number two Hello pile 2, whoever chose this stone, let's see, are you ready for those changes that are coming ahead? <laughs> Eight of Cups. For pile 2, uh, you're not expecting this change. If pile 1 manifesting this you are not expecting this change what kind of change you kind of already turned from this uh, situation are you not looking that way anymore what is this about maybe even you forgot about this it's kind of in the past this is this change you wanted in the past or you worked on in the past you're not looking that way anymore what is this about? Could be about a person. I just heard the word devastated. You were devastated by this situation uh, before. You realized that this is not good for you or this wish or this relationship this job this person this situation it's not good for you and you move down from it why uh, why is it coming now what is this about something has shifted I see now listen pile number two it's a situation where you already moved on and maybe even have other plan other choice other person other job you already have something else or you already looking somewhere else and you know that usually happens when we already move, move down from somewhere or something 
it's 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 happening it's kind of too late but it's happening just because we let it go so you will have a choice here and i even see that uh you will be looking at this situation not emotional you're not gonna be emotional about this if pile one was emotional or will be emotional about what's changes that's coming ahead you are not you are very um mentally prepared for it so you prepared for the change but you're not looking there or you're not um, expecting that or you not counting on that and because of that <laughs> it's going to be here I'm just I just want to know why why uh, you need this if you do if you even need this I don't know I see now so whatever you already have or already counting on or looking at right in order to make the right choice you need several because the more choices we have the, the less emotional we are why because we have choices when we have only one thing or one, only one thing to count on we kind of worry that we may lose something but when we have more than one and we have we can look we can step back and look at the situation and say okay uh, i have several choices um i'm in abundance so uh, this comes to you for the sake of of a choice i don't know why maybe you um, found a new job and you're not sure if this is uh, the job you should remain at or you look for more and then something that should be wanted before is coming and then you're gonna see both um, choices and you're gonna just look at them um, without being emotional or worrying about losing something and that's when you're gonna see clearly what you need to choose for some you're choosing a person the emperor any gender for some it's a relationship this situation will make you see clearly uh, what you should work on uh, what you should choose who you should choose um, it's gonna give you even clarity here this is not because you're looking back and now you're gonna like be even more um, confused no this is for the clarity but you ready you ready for whatever's coming you ready uh, you're gonna be ready in any circumstances but I'm, I'm just telling you for some in order to make the right decision you have to see clearly it's like you're making this a difficult choice here or important this is important maybe another example i just heard for some you are planning to move to another city or country or uh, build uh, did i say build maybe even build build or buy a house and then suddenly the offer that you or the house that you wanted before or the place that you all wanted to go before you suddenly get approval or you suddenly get a visa or you suddenly get um accepted somewhere and you're like oh so should i still go go where i already chose was this really the right choice or i'm just going there because i have no other choices important but you are ready while uh, two you may not expect what's coming ahead something from your past will show up again but just for you to see things clearly and to listen to your heart what your heart really wants so take it as 
as something that you need right now, not as something that you upset with right now or uh, that confuse you. No, it's not going to confuse you. It's even going to make your decision more clear. One way or another. Beautiful. Thank you very much, pile number two. Uh, let me know in comments and I'm going for pile number three. Hello, pile three, whoever chose this uh, stone. Are you ready for this change that's coming ahead? Queen of Swords, of course. For pile three, you ready to cut the cord. You ready to make things clear. You ready for a certain truth. Let's see what is it, what kind of change. What is this about? I have several situations here. Just take whichever resonates with you, and they're very different. For some of you, you will be ready to hear news about a certain couple. I don't know, I hear some couple or some people that somehow related to you or were related to you. You will hear the blunt truth about them and it will completely change your view on them or on certain situation and you maybe even will um, cut this off, cut them from your life or you will speak out and it will give you a certain clarity. For others, uh, those people, I feel, I feel a couple. They don't have to be actual couple. They may be just your friends, family members, uh, people that you know. Um, the point is, they may come to you for a certain clarity. But the the main thing is what you are going to hear. Maybe at first will shock you. But deep down, you are going to be happy that this happened. For some reason, you may not show that you're happy about it. You may not show your emotions. But you will be happy about what's about to come. And those people or what you will know about them or what they will say. For others of you, a completely different situation. Okay. Um, some money was supposed to come to you. I don't know where this money is from. Is this your earnings? Is this your salary? Is this your job? A career situation? Is this some, I don't know, court issue? Whatever it is. Um, but they are your money or they... They're related to you, they're, uh, I don't know, I just hear this is your money, right? And you will, uh, the change will be that you are getting or this money are coming into your pocket, your account. Because that's what you deserve or that's what belongs to you. Something that belongs to you is coming back I hear maybe somebody owned you money or they didn't want to pay or um, it's some inheritance situation I don't know as I said maybe court issue or um, could be anything here 
long awaited money I hear for some they're coming to you you don't really need to do anything here it's just the situation will bring you uh, to the point where you getting what you deserve and you're gonna be happy about it why because you say it's fair this whatever happens is fair the change is fair I know the truth I know what belongs to me and I'm taking it without any hesitation basically uh, don't hesitate pile three uh, the changes are coming and you own them is there anything else for pile number three for some of you even you will uh, own a certain trip maybe somebody else will pay for a trip and you're gonna say this is right or they own me that trip I don't know why this uh, information is coming how you can apply it in your life or somebody may surprise you with a trip or something or some money but you're not gonna feel um, that you wanna say oh thank you the, thank you it's so nice of you no you this is this belongs to you or you earn it or you own it it was supposed to be that way You're going to be in the energy of the Queen of Swords and it's fair. It's fair. No guilt. No worry. You're ready for this change because you know this is supposed to happen. Or maybe somebody gave you a promise before but they never accomplished this promise. And when they actually do, you're just going to be a neutral or you're going to be straightforward. You take it and you have no doubts. And you say, it was supposed to happen a long time ago. But okay, I accept. Maybe you will accept someone's offer. Someone's uh, could be work-related, relationship-related. You take in the offer. But uh, the point is... The offer was always belonged to you. Maybe somebody took your place before, your position. You say, and I'm taking it back. Interesting energy for pile number three. Let me know in comments if you already know what it might be about. But uh, you don't have to. It's the change is coming. Uh, your way so you don't really have to do anything it will just happen yeah so that's what I had for you today guys thank you very much I love you all and I'll see you in my other videos bye bye